while writing the next version of Tismi, I realized that I probably had enough HTML5 support to handle the Amazon Cloud Reader. The Amazon Cloud Reader makes it possible to read Kindle books through a HTML5 supporting web browser. So I started writing a little separate program called Firestarter, which implements enough HTML5 to support the Cloud Reader. It also has a number of little user interface tweaks to make it actually usable on a small device like the N9. So here we can see my library page showing various books and we can scroll through this either using the little up down buttons at the bottom here or by using the volume controls at the top. and if we actually open up a book it will start downloading it to the device so that we can make use of it when we're offline as well. So this is what things look like when you're actually reading a book. Uh, again you can turn pages either by pressing the right and left sides of the screen or by using the volume controls. And if you press towards either the top or the bottom of the screen, you get a little pop-up display showing either your location in the book at the bottom or various controls at the top. So you can open up some settings like the uh, font size settings and decide what color you want things, what sort of size of margins you want, that sort of thing. And if we just cancel that. Uh, and if we head back into the library, and then switch off my network capabilities, so if we go into flight mode, so it can no longer access the internet at all and then head back into the application if we look in the downloaded tab we can see the book that I just had open plus a couple of books that I downloaded manually so if we open this up again we get prompted a couple of times to see if we want to uh, switch our network connection back on but if we just ignore those it comes right back up and we can continue reading where we left off and keep going throughout the whole book. It also synchronizes with any other Kindle devices that you have. So if you read a certain way in this and then switch to another device, you'll pick up where you left off. Uh, if we restart the network connection and go back to the library we can manually download books as well besides just opening them if we hold down on the book the little menu pops up and then you can click if you're less clumsy than me you can click download and pin book and it starts downloading the book with a little progress indicator so once that downloads complete it will appear in the downloads tab like the other books did so hopefully this should be available in the OV store reasonably soon and you can start reading Kindle books on your N9